Chris, thank you. And on social media this morning, hashtag Bible is one of the top trending hashtags on Twitter as you wake up and hop on your page. You'll also see hashtag photo op. Over a million people have been talking about this through the night and now into the morning. The White House tweeted this video that you'll see in full on your screen. It shows the president walking from the White House to St. John's Church. It's a very historic church where nearly every president has prayed. But what they don't really show in this video, they don't show at all, is the protesters happening behind the scenes. So before the president actually held uh, that picture, holding up the Bible right there that you see on your screen, uh, you don't see that protesters were dispersed quickly with tear gas and flash grenades outside of the White House so that the president could make that walk to the church. We do have a statement from uh, the, the, here. Here's the next video if you didn't see it um, of New York Times tweeting that out. So here's the statement from the Bishop of the Episcopal Diocese of Washington releasing this and saying that she didn't even receive a courtesy call. She said that she found out that the president was doing this by watching it on the news herself, that she is outraged and she does not want the president speaking for St. John's. A North Carolina Representative Alma Adams tweeting this, that chemical agents should not be used on Americans, especially for a photo op. A lot of people agree with her this morning. They felt that it was just a photo op and definitely unnecessary. Others think it was a sign of strength. We want to know what you think this morning. Use hashtag WakeUpCLT. Join this conversation. Already over a million people are still talking about this this morning. Ben. Yeah, the president in his remarks there said that he's a, a friend of a peaceful uh, protesters across the country. And it seems like based on, on reports not only from our network but from other networks and news agencies that that those protesters outside the white house were being peaceful up until that moment they were being cleared so he could uh walk across the street to the church so some people question if uh he is supportive of some of those peaceful protesters all right rachel thank you we appreciate it